This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff so you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see man analyzing that data. But like I tell every day, the day they release us is false. I'm going to give some false narrative to market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, I see a lot of people talking about AMC is going to run this week. The charts tell them it's going to run, the RSI and, and all this other stuff. And I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell AMC. What I'm telling you is this. The charts are not going to tell us when AMC is going to run, okay? And you chart guys, I, I respect your your charting skills. But the charts are not going to tell us when AMC is going to run. AMC is too heavily manipulated. They don't have to buy stocks in the open market. They don't have to do anything but keep making counterfeit shares because the SEC, the DOJ, the FBI are not going to ask them the right questions so they can do what they want. Not saying AMC can't run. That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is it can't be predicted by any charts and that's just my opinion maybe i'm wrong maybe i'm totally incorrect and you guys know better than me but i can't see any chart indicating when these criminals are going to stop breaking the law really bottom line anyway the amc volume was 12 million six hundred fifty four thousand two hundred and sixty five um, the calls of the money, 7961 at $5, another 41417 But like I tell y'all every day, the call options mean absolutely nothing whatsoever because they, it will never gamma squeeze, okay? I don't care what anybody tells you. I mean, do your own DD, come to your own conclusion. But as far as I'm concerned, it will never gamma squeeze because they don't have to buy shares in the open market. I mean, I say it every day. And people still think that, that these, these call options mean anything. They mean nothing because they decide where the price is until they run out of money or some black or white swan event happens. I mean, that's really the bottom line. Okay. Fintel is saying there's 24,104,314 AMC shares available to short. No idea where these shares come from. We know retail investors aren't selling they've been holding they're already down 95 percent why would they sell at this point it makes absolutely no sense and they're saying they only need 2.18 days to cover so if they only need 2.18 days to cover why haven't they covered and got out the play i mean they keep saying the stock is garbage they keep saying it's going to zero Fintel's reporting that they only need 2.18 days to cover their short position. So why don't they cover their short positions, take all these, these big wins, they should be up by 95%, and get out the play? You know why? Because they can't get out the play. Because they created too many counterfeit AMC shares. They created billions, probably trillions, of counterfeit AMC shares. And this 2.18 days to, to, to cover is absolute nonsense. Because if that was true, they would have covered and got out in two days. They would have covered and got out, and we wouldn't be having these conversations. Also, 48, 41.8% of the volume was shorted shares. Okay? Absolutely crazy. So about 5 million of the volume was shorted shares. Where did these shorted shares come from? Nobody knows. They will not show us any blue sheets. They will not show us any chain of custody. They will not show us where these shares originated from because they originate nowhere. That's really the bottom line. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think if these bad actors only needed 2.18 days to cover, they would have covered and got out the play a long time ago? Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.